under the gender component of HICAP, uh, we have three major questions that we are asking. The first question is, what is the gendered impact of climate change on men and women in this region? How are they being affected differently? I, you know, we know that literature talks about these different impacts, uh, but in, in a lot of places it has also been raised that we, we need data to show exactly how it is affecting men and women differently. The second question that we are asking through this program is, uh, you know, uh, what are the existing um, adaptation practices uh, followed by men and women in the region, and what are their current adaptive uh, capacities to deal with these changes? And the third step is, having identified uh, the impacts of climate change on men and women and the gaps in adaptive capacities of these men and women, we pilot uh, certain action research uh, to say how can we enhance these capacities. Um, so we have uh, really combined these three steps together in the gender component. Uh, and we have complemented this by integrating gender very strongly in other components of HICAP, which include ecosystems and, and food security and vulnerability and adaptation. So all in all, it has a you know, really a very, very cohesive approach on not just mainstreaming gender, but also trying to get gender-specific information for the region on climate change.